Suicide Squad, the Nostalgia Critic review had just dropped at the Nostalgia Critic website. And even though I really enjoyed the film, I can't wait to see, actually see if he does tear this apart. Because I do have a lot of nitpicks and problems, but overall, I had fun with the movie. So, let's get into this. Suicide Squad. Thirty two minutes. Okay. Starting any time now. someone sitting down for 20 minutes just talking about the main characters. Her name is Amanda, played by Viola Davis. 
She's an intelligence officer with an idea so insane it's just crazy enough not to work. Who do we call when the next Superman comes to take us out? Wonder Woman. No. Bat Flash. No. Aquaman. No. Cyborg. Cyborg. No. Batman. No. Lego Batman. How about the villains those heroes fought? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> that would be our movie, actually. Though they arguably save hundreds of lives, that's not what happens. They actually hear her out. If another person as strong as Superman comes, we have to be ready. Are you seriously telling me that supervillains will do less harm than Superman? Did you forget how good Metropolis looked after Superman saved it from Zod? Okay, yeah. Really? Let's look at these crazies. <laughs> Our first mugshot is Deadshot. Damn this assassin around and possible savior of Will Smith's career. He is his favorite of Will Smith's career. Keeper when he pisses off the wrong people. <laughs> It's over, Deadpool. Deadshot! Oh. Well, this <laughs> yeah. one got a lot less cool. Oh, please. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh. Can we have Come on. Anything? He'll just turn you into a cold-hearted monster that any decent human being would immediately lose affection for. Isn't that Batfleck right yeah, now? Yeah, well, that's never stopped me before. <laughs> Move out of the way, kid. I'm gonna shoot your daddy. I was talking to him, <laughs> not you. Oh, sorry. Usually when people are angry about a costume man killing people, it's about me. You win, kid. Mm. Oh, but I wanted to kill him. <laughs> just shoot him in the leg. I'm Batman. Oh my god, he Next shot him in the leg just Captain like I said. He's pretty much rock stated from Ninja Turtles before he was a rhino. <laughs> His superpower? You mm. guessed it. Boomerang. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to take down the next Superman with a boomerang. Admittedly, it does sound stupid. Amazing. <laughs> but she'll be distracted when I tell you that the Flash is in this movie. Oh. God. Just like in the DBS movie. Oh, what is that disgusting reptilian beast? That's the reason people are going to have to call us Academy Award winning Suicide Squad. Our team Even with the El Diablo and Joker. The scaly Warner himself, the Croc. Oh my god. That is a. a dinosaur. <laughs> Oh my god. But we're safe. I'm a dinosaur. So we'll just skip him for now. Holly Quinn, the Joker's girlfriend. What's her superpower? Fan service. She used to be Dr. Holly Quinzel. She was assigned to the clown himself. He got inside her mind. Obviously, fan service. But Emily, she is a cool character. Okay, are you reading her criminal record or her trading record? Hmm. I guess her trading record. <laughs> well, what does her criminal record say about how she can help us? Um, <laughs> she has a mallet. Okay, last one. <laughs> okay, last one. The Enchantress. <laughs> a young doctor went exploring in a cave and got possessed by an evil witch. She wants to take over the world, and may have the power to do so. Under our control, though, mm. she is the most powerful thing alive. Mm. And that's all you need. <laughs> what? The Enchantress. Mm. That's all you need. You can chuck the rest of that binder into the garbage. Hey, I worked hard to find the worst of the worst. And you came across boomerangs, mallets, <laughs> guns, a petting zoo, and a guy who makes fire who no longer makes fire. This <laughs> is all you need. All your attention should be on her. He's right. We don't need to worry about them as long as we have that witch under control. Yeah, mm. what do you got her under a uh, lockdown or military surveillance? Better. We have one guy looking after her in a hotel room. But that, that's what clearly the... not enough! What are you, a moron? Obviously! I assure you, it's okay. I can call <laughs> to prove it. Obviously, it's not enough. Oh, hi, Colonel Amanda here. I was just wondering how... What's that? Oh. Uh-huh. Oh. <laughs> Just let me know how that works out. <laughs> she fucked up. So it appears she's escaped. <laughs> Who would have known the person that's been on taking over the world would have tried to rule the world. <laughs> I'm 
Oh my Jimmy god. Jimmy Bean security guard is played by Ike Barinholtz. He's given a surprise visit in his off time by Mr. J. I can't wait to show you my toys. I know. You mailed me your anal beads last week. That was <laughs> the old me. The new me wants to show you my actual scary toys. We're not going to see them, are we? No, that seems like a As well as this scene. Of course. But that doesn't mean that I can't hurt you off screen. Ready? Well, knock it off, Jim, and let Walter go. But I thought about what you said, Craig. I need to get more psychotic to get into character. In fact, if you look under your desk, you might find another present I left for you. <laughs> Christ, <Jim. laughs> A dead mouse. Oh, yeah, yeah, you really opened your game there. Well, not just any dead mouse. Doesn't it look a little familiar? Like a certain pet you have at home? No, that is the character of the Joker. Douche of a boyfriend said to give you that. Aw, how sweet. <laughs> You're in so much trouble. <laughs> trouble? Big trouble? What kind of trouble? What's gonna happen to me? Nothing. Nothing happens to him. <laughs> yeah, he disappears from the film altogether, in fact. <laughs> ah, another one of our brilliant cuts. We fizzled that dizzle. Or shizzle. My dizzle. <laughs> Yeah, but literally any payoff would have worked here, no matter how tiny. The Joker could I actually never home, noticed take that. Him out while on a run, or since he's fond of mailing things, he could get this in the mail. No! <laughs> it takes less than a day to shoot any of those. You don't understand, Critic. We're doing it for the fans. Yeah, you keep yeah but the fans want that also. It means also. we don't have to explain that much because the fans already know. Like, look at this character on their mission. I am Katana, and my sword holds the souls of the enemies that I kill with it. Here's a clip of me doing stuff with it. Hmm. Ooh. You see, that's all they need to know. No, no we, we need to know more. Story down, but we don't know her. What's her personality, hmm. interests, dislikes, character traits? It's not like, say, an X-Files movie where the characters are already established in a TV show. This is a different interpretation that needs to be established. Look, I know our competitors. They may or may not have a talking raccoon. Give their characters individual movies and then put them together into one. That makes audiences understand them better and cheer for them when they come together. I totally forgot where I was going. <laughs> However, our fans don't need that because they've got the comics. Gandalf would be so much so, stronger if they replaced him. Not with all movies have to backs. follow the comics. Well, you know this guy, right? In fact, we were even toying with the idea of replacing every character in this movie with recommended issue numbers. That way they can read up on the characters, and we don't even have to write them. So while you may think for the fans means lazy, we like to think it means... not that. <laughs> Name one personality trait of Katana. Oh, I don't know. I don't read comics. So the guy watching the Enchantress, who also died. happens to be in love with her, is Rick Flagg. This guy is like Ford, the main character in Godzilla, and that he's so forgettable you probably don't even realize this isn't Ford from Godzilla. This is. Because he can pretty much be switched out with anyone, I'm just gonna play his part. You? Why you? Because if characters can be introduced with no rhyme or reason, why can't I be one? He's tricked by the Enchantress to break out of Amanda's control along with her resurrected brother. This calls for the most unqualified people in the world. Obviously. But he so looked he leads really his team cool. of villains to stop the Enchantress mm -hmm. from taking over the world and wait a minute. How come I didn't get any bright credits or backstory? <laughs> oh, uh, I don't know. <laughs> what, the Native American guy doesn't get any attention? Oh, no. I'm oh, like that is... I'm just here to die, aren't I? <laughs> no, 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 Yes, it is. You're going to use the remote in that hand to blow up the chip inside my head. <laughs> Everybody has a chip in their head, okay? If you try mm -hmm. to escape, you die. All right? I'm not singling anyone out. I think he's lying. You should give it a shot. D did you hear that? He's trying to kill me. Discount Sokka here is trying to kill me. For God's sake, you're not just here to die. What's my name? Uh, Sliptic? Oh. Oh. Spirit. 
iron knife? Thunder I'll just go with slip deck. Cleveland red hmm. shirt. Dances with lawyer from Jurassic Park. You know what? Screw you guys. I'm not dying for any of <laughs> you assholes. All right, fine. I'll dismantle your chip out of white guilt. You happy? <laughs> <laughs> You know, you're right. Killing people really helps me get into character. Who would have thought it was so inspiring? Damn it, Jim, you real asshole! Stop killing my cat! Don't blame me. Blame the character. <laughs> I know it's a risky method, and people probably won't like me for it, but I thought the sacrifice was worth it for the character. Now what are you doing? Well, that's the whole reason why I'm doing this. So I can gloat to reporters about how awesome I am. Get out of here! What do you think about people claiming you're only doing this for attention? They're right. <laughs> okay, everybody. You know what? We'll continue with part two. Ah. So many things are true here. Just so many things. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please leave a like. Subscribe, comment, and I'll see you guys next time in part two of the, this reaction video.